dinner with a buddy and we hadn't been in the store yet since it moved. And I, and I know Justin, so I saw him. Oh, man, it's custody of the bush. Do the stories on it. Yeah, okay. Hey, I'm Brent Jackson, <laughs> and uh, I'm here outside the horseshoe, and I'm going to interview this guy, Wayne, uh, and we're going to, you know, have a loose, casual conversation about <laughs> Cuff the Duke and uh, their new record. Where was the album recorded? We recorded it at uh, Greg Keeler's farm. Okay, uh, so last January. And uh, did you commute all the time, or did you? No, we just stay out there. We kind of hang out at his place. It's kind of cool because you know he's in the middle of this really nice little valley, and it, you know it's the winter, so it's snowy. Yeah, just kind of hang out. It's nice to seclude ourselves. So we yeah. we recorded the whole thing and basically mixed it in five days. Oh, awesome. we sort of like hunkered down and. I actually, it was weird because I didn't leave the house for five days. The other guys went out and walked around a couple times, but I was just, I realized on the last day that I hadn't been inside in five days. Were your eyes sinking in the back? Yeah, there, it was a little weird when I finally did walk outside on the last day to break the, to break the, whatever personal record I had for being indoors. <clears throat> it was bizarre and cold. Entirely happy with it. Like, would you yeah, do this really process proud of again? It. Oh yeah, totally. We're gonna go out there again, probably in the spring, and record it again. Because there's a follow-up. So actually, this album is part one of a two-part. Oh, amazing album. I think so. The next album is basically written. Well, it's all written, and uh, yeah, we just need to record it. Yeah. So yeah. You um, from the get-go think about having a part one, a part two? Or? Well, yeah, we just had a ton of songs, and we thought like, well, you know, we could do a double record, but yeah. Yeah, oh, something felt a little cheesy to us about that, and it kind of—it's a weird undertaking too, you know. Yeah. Put out a double record and then tour that, but we thought it'd be kind of smarter for us if we just made two records and then not take two years to put out a record. Yeah. So put out one record one year, put out the next record the next year. Yeah. You know, so that we could then hit the road again with a whole new album, which sort of seemed to make the most sense to us yeah. and the best way to sort of utilize all the songs. 